Uh, SWAG was created in 2018. The birth of SWAG really came about from a few individual women who felt marginalized within the agriculture sector here that exists to provide women growers and farmers of Samoa with opportunities for business, networking, training, and education. We use the term grower because uh, when you say farmer, there's often a gendered as aspect to that. There's a presumption that already this is a man's job and uh, that you have a lot of land in which you're farming. And for a lot of women, they uh, don't have access to large amounts of land. So they're growing things around their home to, to feed their families, to earn a little extra income on the side. And we just wanted to remind people that if you're growing something, you actually are farming. There was no organization that said we are keen to advocate for women, to make sure that women's issues are actually incorporated into policies, incorporated into strategic plans, and to make sure that women are actually involved in the decision making and involved in the design. We're also seeing that they're changing what are the requirements for um, those women to participate. You don't have to all of a sudden have to have five acres of land or have this type of equipment, etc. And that's the way to guarantee that women who want to become more involved in the agriculture sector can now start slowly transitioning into becoming more experienced growers. The COVID pandemic affected Samoa in March of 2020, so this dramatically affected the agriculture sector in terms of um, our local market. It also made it very difficult for export. Our members came to us and they said, look, we don't have the Sunday market anymore. It's been closed down because of the state of emergency. So the COVID reality caused us to create a space that we hadn't anticipated creating. But because of it, we're so grateful that we have because we have such a broader, wider family now because of the swag market. We're keen to actually do a workshop where we train up those who have just stepped into the formal space, are just practicing what it's like to be a business owner, but then learn about how online marketing can expand dramatically not only the type of clientele they have, but also the way in which they can share their products with others. So that's the next step for us, getting these women who've created all these amazing products to be known to the world. Thank you.